All right, and we're back. So, uh, the recording went fine. I tried to change some settings, but I wasn't able to, so I just got to make sure that I don't overclick the screen. Let's go over this wonderful looking bridge. Huh, I guess we'll head up here. Ah, this looks like the, uh, I think the gate that they were closing earlier. No point. It's locked. I'll come back when the funeral is over. Huh. That's, uh, strange. So yes, we'll just uh, explore some more. Let's talk to this guy again. Let's see if he has anything else to say. Hello again. If you have five minutes to sit and talk, I could tell you a thing or two about the olden days. I am sorry. Oh, why not? I, I really am in a hurry. Ah, uh, it is a pity. Okay. Apparently she doesn't want to do anything. Let's go in. I guess we'll talk to uh, the guy again. How does he... How does he know that we're coming up? I'm back again. Miss Walker? Uh... Could you tell me where I can find a notary here in Valadilen by the name of Alfalter? We only have one notary here and his house is easy to recognize. You can't miss it. Okay. Could you tell me where I can find a notary here in Valadilen by the name of Alfalter? We only have. I'm gonna go. As you like, me. Huh. So we have to go find a notary. Maybe it's the one I didn't check. It's a little strange. I didn't. I checked these, I think. No need Maybe to go down there. Again. I guess not. Let's keep on going down. Here? No need to go down there. Maybe this guy knows. We're closed. Try tomorrow. In here? No need to go down there. Nope. I believe we tried this one. It's gotta be this one. Hasn't it? Uh... Strange. Oh, these are the okay. So we put something in his hand, it scans it, and that's what we got to do. So, uh, there we go. So here we are. Ooh, look at the little figures here. That is strange. Huh. 
I wonder. This may be for later. Where was he? He was here, wasn't he? Or is this the way in? Hello, sir. Miss Walker, I presume. Ah. Have you had a good journey? Everything went very smoothly. Thank you. Do take a seat, Miss Walker, please. All right. I imagine you are aware of the business that brings me here. Of course. I was waiting for you. I am the uh. legal representative for the Universal Toy Company. I'm responsible for... So I understood, Miss Walker. Okay. Uh, Miss Walker, I am afraid that the sale of the Vorlberg factory is not as straightforward as it first seemed. Whoa there. Everything was agreed. We'd obtained Anna Vorlberg's consent, and her death does absolutely nothing to invalidate that. Now, I have to be back in New York the day after tomorrow, Metro Alphotair. My client and I are impatient to seal this deal. I understand only too well, Miss Walker. <clears throat> There is a... an heir, Miss Walker. Excuse me? An heir? But Madame Varlberg never married, as far as I know. And in my last conversation with her, she absolutely never mentioned this detail. Miss Walker, believe me, I was more surprised than you are. Anna Varlberg sent me a letter two days before she died. Understand, Miss Walker, that had I known about this earlier, I would have informed you. I shall read you the document in my possession. <clears throat> okay. I am so very old. It seems that today life is slipping away from me more quickly than I imagined, and I fear that I will not be of this world to sign the takeover contract for my dear factory. So, I must make this confession to you now. My brother, Hans, is still alive. It would not surprise me if you find this difficult to believe, but it is indeed the truth. You must remember his death, his funeral, too, even though you were very young at the time. It was but a sordid charade dreamt up by our father. To him, the very idea that his only son should wish to leave Baladilen and abandon the family business was unbearable. When Hans left, he preferred to think him dead and make everybody else believe this too. He obliged me to bear this terrible secret as well. I repeat that Hans is still alive, so when I die, it is he who becomes the sole and rightful heir of our factory. Okay, I see. Okay. If Hans Barlberg is not dead after all, then I just have to sign the contracts with him. I suppose you've already contacted him? Where can I reach him? The second half of the letter informs us that Hans Barlberg is somewhere in Siberia. I will leave the document in your hands to read at your leisure. Huh. Siberia. Anna Varlberg so had it. no further information to add? Unfortunately not, Miss Walker. I have told you as much as I know. The situation in legal terms is now clear. If you want to conclude this sale, you have to find Hans Varlberg. Apparently there is a body lying in the town cemetery. There also seems to be some ghost wandering around Siberia. It seems you have your work cut out for you. B believe me, Miss Walker, when I say that I am most sorry for this regrettable setback. Most sorry. Great. What now then? Perhaps you will find out more in the Varlberg factory archives. You will find the key in the waiting room. My role in this affair finishes here with the reading of this letter. And now, if you'll excuse me, I must rest. You see, my health is not excellent at the moment, and my doctor forbids me from working for too long. I will not detain you for any longer, Miss Walker. Do not forget to close the door as you go out. Goodbye, sir. 
Ah, so, uh, Momo was correct. Is there anything for us to... steal? This must be his room. No need to go down there. How many times am I going to hear that? <laughs> 